Hey ladies, it's Allison here and I just wanted to come to you really quickly and share with you, um, actually introduce you to my mop top here. So, um, today for the very first time like in ever, I think, that I've been natural, which is over four years now. I'm actually just air drying my own hair without any products, curl definers, anything, and taking a good look at my curl pattern. And um, I didn't like, I didn't comb through it or anything. I, I mean, I did detangle it in the shower. I just washed it this morning. Um, actually, I washed it like 50 million times this morning because I wanted to. I did a deep treatment with like olive oil and castor oil and some other oil mixtures and um, yeah like there's tea tree in it and stuff like that and I just I had done a henna treatment the night before so that's why I did a hot oil treatment so I just wanted to take a look at how my curls would turn out if I just put a leave-in conditioner, which was um, like a Darcy's Botanical leave-in conditioner. Um, so it's very lightweight consistency. I'm trying to figure out if I should go grab it or not. But it's like a watery consistency, so it didn't, it's not a curl definer or anything like that. And it does not have any hold to it. It's just to moisturize my hair so I don't um, dry out my hair. And then I put oil, which was my camellia oil, on top. And so this is what my hair looks like. And I honestly feel like this is like the first time I'm seeing my own curls in their natural, like doing what they want instead of what I want them to do. Back hair is kind of still wet. And so what I notice is my hair, okay, it shrinks like a lot without any um any um curl definers or anything like that in there it shrinks a lot of a lot of a lot of a lot of a lot but i don't actually mind the shape that it turned out in at first i don't know this part which is in the front of my hair it drying it it was drying um longer well it still dried longer than this part which is behind it so it it dried really short right here which it's whatever it has a it has a pretty good shape to it and then right down here i noticed it has a different like curl altogether but um it's rather interesting mm -hmm. you yeah. know i'm just going to show you how long Parts of my hair actually are in comparison to what it looks like because right now it kind of looks like it's floating on top of my shoulders kind of thing like my earrings are longer than the hair and my hair actually is like about armpit length and here's another piece armpit length and here's a piece from the top which would not probably be armpit length and it's not really dry I should have probably not pulled on that woo anyway that part was not dry um let's see right here it's like just above armpit length because my hair is in layers but yeah if I um if I'm styling my hair I tend to pull on it while I'm putting in my product and so it ends up drying like here like that like longer but not like off my shoulders like this and then up here again it's not as I guess it's just not as short as it it looks not that I'm hating on the shrinkage because I I actually um, appreciate shrinkage I don't know why Maybe simply because this is my hair type or whatever. But yeah, that's my hair. And here's the top. Like, the texture at the top in general 
So from the roots to the ends is just a little bit different. And um, in the front, looks like that. And yeah. I have to say that I am quite surprised at how my hair dries without anything in it. And I don't not like it. Like I actually Like if I had styled my hair like this and whatever, if I just put like some type of holding agent in my hair, I would wear it this short and this curly and this boom bam bam bastic type of thing. I would wear it like that. But uh this has no gel in it, so uh, I wouldn't go and risk the tangling and stuff. Anyway, I'll see you guys later.